famous tire monitor system. Hmm. Let's see if we can fix that. Okay, so the tire pressure sensor is on, and that's these little um, sensors located inside of your tires. That tells how much pressure your tire has when it gets below a certain amount of pressure. It sends a signal to the computer to say that the tire pressure is low. So we bought some aftermarket tires. They didn't have these sensors in them. So now the light is on. We don't want the light to be on. What we want to do is to fix it, but we don't want to pay to get the sensors put on and we can't do it ourselves. So we're making this little device. It's PVC with two caps on the end. We'll put the, a valve on the little container that we built out of PVC and put the sensors inside. Put the lids on and put glue on them and pump it full of air until it reaches the right pressure, the same pressure that's in the car to the tire that we're needing to put them on. We'll see how it works. So this is what we're going to use. We've got the PVC tube, we've got the two end caps. We drill the hole, we measured the valve that we're going to put in with the um, calipers to make sure we got the right size drill bit. And then we're going to uh, install this into here in rubber cement just to make sure it's good and tight. And these are the sensors that we're going to put in there. So put these four sensors in here. Um, after we put the top on, well, you know, before we glue it down, we're going to put the sensors in. So that's what we'll do. I'm being dancing to the beat of my own drum. <laughs> This is the device that we are, um, that we've created. The sensors are inside of here. Got this tightly glued down. We're about to pump it up to the right pressure. We're just waiting, the glue is still a little wet, so wait for that to harden before we go on to the final step of pumping it up to the right pressure. And once we do that, we're gonna put it in the truck, just like, you know, in the console or glove box or something like that. And uh, take a drive and see if the light goes off. And um, the, the tire pressure monitoring system, the light is not one that you can turn off with some kind of co-reader or unplugging the battery. It's not part of that system. The only way to clear that code is to replace your tire pressure monitoring sensors or do something like this. So let's see if it works. Good morning. I'm not sure if I mentioned earlier that the Sierra, the 08 Sierra is the truck that we're working on for this. And so this morning we let it dry overnight. I have the device here and I have an air pump with a gauge on it so I can tell how much pressure I'm putting in. We're going out to the Sierra now to check to see how much pressure we need to put in. I think it's around 40 PSI, but I'm not 100% sure. So let's go see. So in theory, this light should actually go out, even if we're staying still, if we put the tire pressure sensor in. So let me just flip this camera around to show you the dash where it says the service tire pressure. There you go. So you can see that. So I'm going to be out here pumping this up and we'll see if it changes.
does seem a little dangerous. Forty. Let me see if I turn it off and turn it back on a couple times if it'll go out. got to be some connection between the tire pressure monitoring system and the tires with the sensors on them. The tires spin, there's no wires or anything where it could communicate besides some kind of wireless communication. So it really seems to me logical that this device would work. I'm not sure why it's not. The light wasn't on before when we had the old tires on, so we know the sensors are working. I don't know, we'll keep working on it and see what we can figure out. <laughs> All right, so if y'all see me driving down the street and I got a flat tire, you know I don't have any sensors in there telling me. So go ahead and wave. Hey, you got a flat tire. <laughs> no, I'll pull over and change it. <laughs> Thanks. Remember to like and subscribe. And uh, if I can do it, so can you. Even though this one was kind of a failure. <laughs> it's all good. It's all fun. Take it easy.